Hey y'all. <clears throat> hey y'all, it's Rita May and I'm coming on real quick y'all with a vlog y'all. Um, I think y'all gonna see a lot of me on this journey. <laughs> I feel like talking and who better to talk to than my YouTube family. Um, cause y'all, y'all rock with me. I'm just waking up. I'm about to get ready, get ready for the day. And, um, uh, I know y'all like, girl, but, um, I ain't worrying about it because I know I can look cute when I need to look cute. But, um, yeah. I feel like this lock journey is coming at the perfect time, y'all. I feel like I'm going through a, um, I should have put some gloss on. Mm. I feel like I am going through a transition right now in my life with these three boys and just me trying to figure out what I supposed to be doing and this and that. And um, I feel like me and my lot journey is something that is, can't nobody do this for me. You know what I'm saying? So while I was thinking about my lot journey and everything like that, I was like, um, what do I expect my locks to look like? Um, you know, you put them in, and now the first thing you worry about is like, what are they gonna look like? Is they gonna be popping? So this is what I slept with my e bonnet, y'all. I had for like 50 million years. Shout out to Ebony Curls. Congratulations on your new baby. And um, yeah, I'm still rocking my e bonnet, so I got it tied up here, and I am gonna take it off, and um. Throw it on my bed. Shake them out, girl. Shake them out, girl. But, um, this is what it looking like. Wake up and go. I did add a few things. You probably aren't supposed to, but, um, yeah. So, this is what it looking like. This is day two. And I already feel popping, y'all. What? What's, what's going on? What's going on? I, I feel like I needed this. I needed this. I needed this. I needed something for me. Like, this is for me. Y'all, I'm just in my lounge stuff. But, yeah. I needed this for me. But, um, what do I expect them to look like? Um, I'm, I'm not going for super duper neat this time around. I'm not going for free either because you know i'm not that type of chick but um i am going for not super duper neat but neat enough neat though i still want neat though you know um the my hair is high density but my my strands are fine to medium and every time i say that people are like you do not have no fine strength. I do. I have, uh, like, all around my perimeter and, like, up in here where I had my situation at, which is, <laughs> what situation? <laughs> Thank you, Lord. But, um, yeah, where I had that at and everything, it's really fine strands and, um, you know, in medium strength, but I just have a high density, so I have a lot of hair on my head so I kept that into consideration um and I also um kept into consideration that my strands are not that um coarse I mean that you know that thick so um y'all see that gray hair in the ham sandwich that is gray hair y'all that is not build up that is gray hair but anyway, um, because my roots and stuff is so thick, it just feel like these are going to be like gigantic. But I mean, they're going to be a good size. They're going to be, I want to say they're going to be slim thick. <laughs> but um, this is one here. And if I twist it at the root to make it tight, which you'll be able to see it better when I do my, my retwist, that... You know, the parting, this is about what size I'm going for. So, if you look at the circumference of 
the part. I'm going for a nice medium size locks and I think I'm looking in the wrong spot, but I'll get it together. But I'm going for more medium size, like medium size. If I would have got medium size um, braids or um, Marley twist or something like that. Um, that's what my parting system went by. I parted it as if I... <sighs> Okay, <laughs> I parted it as if I was doing, someone came to me and said they wanted medium sized Marley Twist or medium sized um, box braids and I know that it's going to swell up and it's going to be for like medium sized Marley Twist, you know what I'm saying? So that's what I kind of kept in mind. Uh, I didn't want them too, too small. Um, I felt like I am, you know, I'm 5'9". I'm a, you know, I'm a big chick, and I don't feel like I should have had thin, thin locks to begin with. Um, at that time, you know, I thought it was, you know, but, you know, you live, you learn, you know. But, um, yeah, day two, and as you see, all I do is just take my bonnet off, and that's it. Shake it out. As you see, my hair is not stiff, so you know that I didn't hardly use no product on my hair. I'm going to show you guys another part too as you can see me. But yeah, right next to it. So you know, the width of them is, and they kind of I don't know, I kind of got my own little way I part. I don't know how to explain it, but it's not really boxes. It's, you know, it's kind of boxy in the back but in the front, I kind of like it to flow a certain way when I flip it over to the side. Um, so I got the part here and then I got, um, I got a middle part I made, I want to say. I think I'm going to retwist it in a middle part next time because I was playing around with that. So yeah, I got a middle part. I think that'd be cute. And, um, ooh, these bags. Lord, do I need to moisturize and put stuff on before I come on? Anyway, and... I got another part that's going to go over this way, just in case I want to go this way, you know, sometimes or something like that, you know. So. <laughs> Y'all, do I probably be feeling myself already? Anyway, I keep walking past, whipping my head. My kids, they keep shaking me, shaking their head at me. I'm going to be, mm, I'm all out. I didn't got my selfie stick. Thanks, sissy. It's my my sister got me this selfie stick a few years ago, and I'm just now using it. And it's gonna come in handy now. See, everything everything is for the right time. Everything, you know. But anyway, let me get off here. It's eight minutes. I'm gonna get up off here. There ain't gonna be no editing. It's gonna be raw footage. I will talk to y'all later. Bye.